the human body is populated by billions of bacteria. Over long periods of time, a partnership has developed, a symbiosis that can take on the most varied forms, often to mutual benefit. In order to prevent pathogens from invading the human body, the external surfaces are protected very effectively. The skin, and in particular the mucous membranes, form a highly flexible protective shield, able to regenerate quickly and cross-linked via the lymphatic system. In spite of an overall length of only 6 to 8 meters, the human intestine with its anatomical structures, folds, villi and protrusions of epithelial cells has a surface of approximately 500 square meters. A large quantity of antigen-specific B lymphocytes, matured into antibody-producing plasma cells, reach the bloodstream via the lymphatic channels and the ductus thoracicus and are distributed in the entire body. Many of these processes of the antigen-specific immune system, from activation of dendritic cells via antigen presentation to the effect of secretory IgA, are regulated by cytokines. Their immunoregulatory effect is determined to a large extent by the interaction of intestinal epithelium and physiological bacteria. <laughs> <laughs>